Halt! Who goes there? You show Sergeant Muldoon the letter from the Headmaster. This darkness has come upon Wizard City so quickly we're overwhelmed dealing with it. I'm glad you're here to help. You're that student everyone is talking about, aren't you? They say you're Wizard City's last hope. And you've just enrolled. You did a good job spooking the spooks on Unicorn Way. But evil is on the move. Push down in one place, something pops up somewhere else. Now it's Old Town's turn. If we lose control of Old Town to the undead, all of the other streets will be isolated and will fall. Here's what we need you to do. Defeat Lady Black Hope and lock her in her tower on Unicorn Way. Do that, and I'll let you pass. Mere mortals should not dabble in the affairs of the undead. Perish now, wizard! the ghost, did you? Very impressive. None of the guards were brave enough to face her. With Old Town secure, I feel better about letting you through to the other streets. But be careful, understand? Something's going on. This place is not as safe as it seems. I hear fearful rumors about a big nasty wraith named Lord Nightshade roaming around. My guess is that he's responsible for much of the trouble Wizard City now faces. There's a kid on Cyclops Lane named Nolan Stormgate. You should talk to him. He sounds like he's in trouble. He's dealing with the giants there and has been asking us to send students. Better go see what he wants. Ah, young one. You seem to have gained a bit more power since our last... Come find me when you can. I have some wisdom that I would like to teach you.
What are you doing here? Only talented wizards like me should be out on these dangerous streets. Think you have what it takes? This place needs real heroes. We'll see if you can make the grade. Let's see how useful you are. Professor Drake put me in charge of a very important mission. Magical artifacts from the old death school have resurfaced. I've decided you're going to recover the one inside the spooky dark cave. Every other student I've asked has been too afraid to go, so I'm hoping for better from you. Battle everything in the dark cave until you find the ruined skull. You found the rune skull? Huh. Faster than I could have imagined. Professor Jake will be pleased with me. I told a few students to pick up death relics up the street. Now they're nowhere to be found. No doubt gabbing instead of working. Can you look after the students on the slim, slim chance that something's happened to them? I'd start with the trolls. They look shifty. What is this? A letter? 
How odd. Trolls can't read. By the handwriting, a Cyclops wrote this. They never dot their eyes. It's addressed to M, whoever that is. I should take a look at it if students are in danger. Great fire, Bats! The Cyclops have kidnapped the students! Oh, good thing you found this. We must act immediately! I hope they're not gonna blame me for those students getting themselves kidnapped. I know! I'll inform Professor Drake at once. He'll know what to do. When I tell him how those students got themselves kidnapped while I was... On second thought, I think you should go tell him. I'll stay here and... Keep an eye on those Cyclops. What do you want? Professor Drake sneers at the ransom note. Here, take this message to Victor Darkwood, the robe shopkeeper. Be quick about it. Time is of the essence here. Ah, a message from Professor Drake. <laughs> yes, yes, I've been expecting you. You'll need to hurry back with this. The shopkeeper retrieves a large sack and hands it to you. Here you go. Professor Drake's laundry. Freshly cleaned and pressed. And don't let it drag on the pavement now. That certainly took you long enough. Professor Drake shakes his head at you. You're still worried about those missing students? Yes, well, this is definitely a problem. Take this message to the headmaster. That should resolve things to my satisfaction. Ah, young wizard, it's good to see you. You have a note for me. Let's see it. The headmaster reads Professor Drake's note. I will not expel you from the Ravenwood School of Magical Arts, regardless of what Professor Drake thinks of you. You are not responsible for the problems on Cyclops Lane. General Achilles and his men promised to drive out the trolls. Now Achilles has gone back on his word. I fear there is something more sinister behind Achilles' change of heart. This M is to blame. We will need to know more. Drake is of no use here, but you have been most helpful. Go back to Nolan Stormgate and help him straighten this out. I want you to introduce yourself. Well, I wasn't expecting Professor Drake to leave everything to us. He must really trust me. Professor Drake is expecting big things. The Cyclops' General Achilles wrote the note, so we need to reach his keep. But to do that, we need a gate pass. Maybe... can you steal one from the Warhorns? All you have to do is defeat some. Yeah! That should be easy enough.
You got the pass? Great job! I'm glad I thought of that. With your magic and my brains, we make an unstoppable team. Okay, here's my plan. Show your pass to the guard, Romulus, outside the keep at the end of the street, and he'll let you in. He's not too bright. Then you must challenge General Achilles in combat. Cyclopses are honor-bound. According to the Cyclops' code of honor, he can't refuse to fight you. See where I'm going? Even if someone is telling Achilles to hold the students hostage, once you defeat him in battle, he will be honor-bound to free them. All you have to do is beat him. Uh, well, you don't look like a war horn to me! But, uh, this pass looks good, so I guess you could go in. You hear a girl's voice off to your left. Help us, please! We're held here by General Achilles! What? You are here to rescue these students? That I cannot allow! I am honor-bound to keep them until I'm told otherwise. But if you were to defeat me, I would be honor-bound to free them for you. If you want their freedom, you will have to fight me for it! And mind you, as General, I will put up a good fight! I must honor your request to free the students. My master will be angry that I let them go, but I must obey the Cyclops' code of honor. Go now! They are free. Thank you for freeing us. We were starting to believe that no one was coming to help us. Thank goodness you showed up. No telling who would have come to rescue us. I thought at least Professor Drake would have come looking for us, but he didn't. Thank you for coming to our aid. Let me get this straight. 
The Cyclops were holding the students hostage in order to bring chaos to Wizard City? But who would make General Achilles do such a thing? I'm sure Professor Drake could figure out who's behind this mess if he wanted to. Too bad he's always so busy. We should tell the Headmaster how we saved the students, especially my plan to sneak you inside the keep. Still, I have to find those artifacts for Professor Drake. After what happened, I shouldn't let anyone else do it. Would you go tell the Headmaster what happened? Tell him how you were able to save them due to my brilliant planning. I'm sure he'll reward us both. Quite a daring rescue. I'm glad that you were able to save the students. It bothers me that someone could force General Achilles into a sinister plot against Wizard City. I suspect that M is Malister himself. It seems obvious that this is another of Malister's plans to throw us off his trail. With all the wizards busy here in Wizard City, Malister feels free to carry out his ultimate plans. Hopefully, we can catch up with him before then. Keep up the good work. Nolan seems to have warmed to you. Perhaps Professor Drake isn't far behind. <laughs>